Welcome guys and good morning. This is going to be a fun session. We're going to take the puppies for a walk and we're going to actually expose them to a variety of situations. We've got a bridge and then also through the slatted stairs. We take all these things for granted. And the thing is that the puppies don't take these things for granted. They get really concerned and really scared. So we'll see how your puppies go with that. All set? Yep. Yeah, yep. Ready. Okay guys, the bridge time. Now, the good thing about this bridge, you can see through it. So they've got this vision down there, they might feel a bit unsure. We've also got exposure because when you come over to this section here, we've got the water flow and we've also got the sound and the bounce of the bridge. So all these things are great opportunities to get these puppies conditioned to this unfamiliar situation. All right, so I think we might go Chance first. Because he's deaf, he needs to be shown exactly what you want him to do. That's it. You might need to use a little bit of touching. Let him say, the, yeah, that's it. Oh, look at that. Good boy. Oh, look at the water going. So that's all interesting. Well done, Jude. Okay, now, Zenji's next, I think. I know he's strong. Just do your best to just take him over to the edge for a moment. Now you can see where he's always a bit unsure there because of the height. Little pat. Good boy. Don't force him, just relax the leash slightly. See how he's observing? Yeah. That's it. Well done. And straight off the other side. Well done. Let's go. Same thing with Timmy. Just take him over to the edge. Let him have a bit of a look. You see how he's unsure of the height? Just take him over to the edge. That's it. Just relax the leash. That's a good boy. Right, they might feel a bit unsure of the height. OK, well done. How easy was that? OK, guys, here we go. Step time. Now, we've got some slatted steps, and this is a pretty complex situation for puppies because they can actually see through. And you might think, oh, yeah, they're used to steps. Yeah, but I understand that. This certainly has a different complexity to it. So we're going to use a lot of encouragement. All right, now, Sinji hasn't done steps like this before, has he? No, he hasn't. All right, so I'll tell you what, I'll take him up first. Let's see how he responds, and then I'll give you a chance to do it. Come on, Sinji. Boop, boop. Come on. Up. Come on. Good boy. So I'm going to go up first. No, he's going up. That's all right. Good boy. Come on, mate. Come on, up here. Up here. That's it. Good boy. Notice I'm not forcing him. He's doing it all by himself, and he's learning by that experience. And now he's on there. He's all a happy puppy. All right, now, we're coming down. So I'm going to sit on the step like this and see if he'll follow me down. Come on, mate. Pop, 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 pop. Come on. Come on. Cool. Give me a kiss. Good boy, yeah. Boy, he's a good boy. Almost there. I think he's a champion. Now, you saw what I had to do. And really, you shouldn't feel sort of a, a bit uneasy about crouching down and doing those, those sorts of things because puppies do feel a lot more confident that way. I think we might go... Chance next. Boy. Now, because he's deaf, you're going to have to show him that. Show him the steps all the way up. Look. Now, you go up, Jude. That's it. Now, we have to use treats a little bit with Chance because of his deafness. We can't use our vocalisation. It's not going to work. <laughs> he's got a lot of confidence with you. Good work. Now, Jude, you need to come back down. What I'll get you to do is you come down first. Bring the food down to the step so he sees where he has to walk. There he is. Oh, it's a big step. Good boy. Good, and he gets a little That's reward. A good job. Well done. Good work today. Just a couple of main points. Expose your puppies as much as possible to a variety of situations. Take advantage of the environment. If you see a pipe, don't avoid it. Get your puppy to go through it. If you see something that the puppy can just do a little jump over, get the puppy to jump over. The idea is to get these puppies conditioned to as many different things that we take for granted every day. All right? Okay, well done, guys. We'll see you next time. Thanks, Thanks Basil. Basil. Thank you.